my proposal was based in the history of the building, let's say. So I understood this building as a collection of layers, which was were adding information like uh, history, cultural program, even like old renovations so were in the building. So in the end, what I wanted to, to make with this project was to add a new layer of information, a simple layer, which was not against this kind of uh, strong condition of the building, but kind of a soft layer which could transform or transfigurate the atmosphere of the mood of, in the end, to add more use to the surroundings or how to expand the current uses of the building. Like the space is very solid, so it will be very, like, blocks your imagination. So we try to make dynamic changes happens inside courtyard. So our proposal is to make a lot of strings going from that way to like a long way, then make it possible to create like a surface with these strings. Our proposal was based on a concept of uh, microarchitecture, so like a small uh, objects placed in the space, and that was all based on the legendary, uh, the modularity of the K67 kiosk. Like that was the basis for our design, and and then our shapes and our proposal was like a, like a like a contemporary reinterpretation of that kiosk. The goal of the competition was also uh, to create a different atmosphere in the courtyard, to create some spaces where you would feel more protected, with, uh, where you would have a uh, shadow, where you would, you would also hide yourself, but also to provide uh, spaces with, where things would, things would happen. But basically the goal was to create some different, different programmatic points around the courtyard. We are very happy with the proposal because actually these points, in a way that uh, Julio Gotor created them, are flexible. We can move them around and position them in the different corners of the courtyard.